Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallet. This is episode 50 of God of War. I've tried different combinations of that thing and I can't get it to work, so I'm giving up. Maybe that's something that we can come back later in, an, in a later part of the game. Uh, that it, it might need, require something else and uh, which we don't have at this point in time. Want me to read this one? What does it say? Falcon, Hawk, and Turtle Dove. Swim aloft in oceans above. Huh? Oh, I thought we solved that one already. I think that's the wind. Uh... Hold on. I'm sure we'll find the answer around here somewhere. Yeah, because we had him, uh, we, we solved that before we saved this. From up here, we can see what it is. Here, boy. Oh, the rest of the runes were hidden over the hill. That's Vinder. When? Back to the sand bowl. See, I, I thought we saw that one. Uh, anyway, what I did was, uh, I, I took a few hours off because this game is pretty intense. Draw it. Sir. Look what it did. Yeah, we opened it already. I just, I guess uh, the game just didn't figure it out. Okay, uh, anyway. Because uh, we quit the game and we, when we came back, it thought we had not... I thought, I thought it would have been a nice, perfect glitch for us to keep <clears throat> picking up some other thing. Father, she is here! It's so good to see you again. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not I'm sure not I understand what... Wait, where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me, now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. <sighs> now, what's this about a head? Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? Take him to the table. Hey, Melin. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well... Thankfully, his head hasn't decayed much, and his brain is still intact. <sighs> nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. <clears throat> now, hold his head under the water, and don't let go. I mean it. She might be more than just a witch. Given can, she can bring things back to life. That's enough. She's got to be more than just a witch. <coughs> yeah, if you can bring. Oh. It works. Let me see him. Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. 
What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the Witch in the Woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either? Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. What? Now. You're welcome. Oh. Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value the privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel, head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Who better to tell us the way? The world serpent? Wait, Wait uh, uh, this is the old Indeed. way, can we? He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? It's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. Oh, we need to take the elevator down. <laughs> so, we've cleared everything here, it looks like. And what is... You know, I... Let's do a quick check on our skills, especially on the bow side. What is the difference between shock potency? Uh, this one, explosive power. Uh, light arrows cause larger explosions. Light arrows inflict a massive amount of stun damage to enemies. How about shock arrows? Uh, shock arrows inflict a massive amount of shock damage to enemies. Wow. So if we need to stun them, we need light. If we need damage, we need uh, we need shock. Shock damage can now be a okay be changed between multiple targets. So it's good always to have the shock uh, shock arrows out shock. Okay, just checking, making sure shock is damaged. Whereas light is stunned. No wonder this is. How can a even an old witch? How can even an old witch? Uh, revive a person unless she's a god or something, right? To work that kind of miracle. Okay, we're going back to Nothing harms him. Aye, Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Boasting of a god, everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved uh, a spell? Mimir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. <laughs> Just need a moment to finish waking up. I hope he's not broken. Oh, went past it. Hey, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. 
Take me to it. Finally, that horn. Okay, uh... Oh. Good. I put my lips to the horn. Oh, we almost got two of them. you made in honor of Thor, and seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? <laughs> no. Our only concern is your name. All right, wish me luck. Uh, ooh, ha, ha, ha. You envy me. I've still got it, lads. You remembers me. Why are you? Direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. That one on the peak where we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, I know where it is, and it's not far. He looked kind of mad for a moment there. Now that, he thought I said you were friends of Odin. <laughs> me. I've never spoken the ancient tongue sober. Wait, look! The water has dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. A new destination. So, okay, we need to go back down. That's tear. Where are we supposed to be headed? Let's check on the map. Okay, uh, huh. Let's look at our goals. The magic chisel. 
Side side Fafnir's hole Fafnir's hoard. The realm of fire. Unlock the realm of Muspelin. Complete the Muspelin language cipher. The Muspelin language disc is complete now. I can make out those runes, even the travel rune for visiting this realm of fire. Where are the runes? No, this is <laughs> wrong way. <laughs> wrong way. So I guess right now we have some level of independent travel right now. Ah, I can read what this says now, but. It's a name. Air! Whoa! The name made it light up! It's the name of one of the Valkyries. That's quite curious. How about this one, kid? Oh, they're the same? I think they're the same, right? Yeah, they look like they're the same. What's this over here? One more for the collection. And then do we go in here? No, we cannot. Oh, that's interesting. Remember we were, we could get in here by, I uh, know this is, This is Jotunheim because the the serpent, the world serpent, moved us over here. So I guess that is now, yeah, that is now the bridge to Jotunheim rather than. The Helheim, Helheim Tower. Mystic Gateway. Mystic Gateway. Asgard Tower. Bartalheim. Nifel, Nifhelm. Nifelheim. So we have to move it all the way over here before we can go to Muspelheim. That's a journey. The journey. Uh, go to journal. Only a very special chisel. Oh, okay. This is our main goal. But if we go to the realm of fire, we cannot. Apparently, we, can, we still cannot. See, I'm clicking it and it will not. The Miss Palheim language is complete. Now I can make out the roots. Unlock. Okay. Uh, hmm. What if we do the... Uh, Fafnir's first. Oh. Where's Fafnir? Fafnir's hold.
Oh. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now, or go explore for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Which way to the chisel? Keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen, then thread past between them. So all this area, can we... Amir, you never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, the wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Enough. Our focus is the road. Completely understand. I'll finish later, lad. Oh, what is that? So in essence, we have a semi-free roam at this point in time. Whoa. Do we want to do this? Not a good one. <laughs> okay, I guess uh, we're not at that level yet. We don't have some. We don't have a level of, of frost protection. So let us not lay our hands on that one. <laughs> it's it's the frost that is killing us. Fafnir. I always wonder what became of him. Wait, Fafnir? Like, Fafnir's storeroom, Fafnir? The very one. But Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was, and now he's a dragon. Funny how life works, isn't it? He's chained up. Perhaps we should keep an eye out for binding shrines and free the poor bastard. Hi, lads. Huh. Whoa, I, I guess uh, we're not ready for dragons. So we might, it might be advisable if we actually just uh, continue with our storyline because these things actually look like they're pretty hard, right? The, uh, when the ocean, uh, when the lake is at its max, it turned out that that is like the beginner's playground. And then we have the high school when the lake came down a bit. And then now we're in the collegiate level. Oh, what's that? A drink from the dew of lasting bonds permanently increase by two hey Mimir. last we were in a boat we had just started the story what did you want to tell me about the long war both sides suffered tremendous losses and for many of us quite frankly war was simply no fun anymore but a rather senseless waste of precious life wouldn't you agree brother <clears throat> precisely Enough was enough, and at last Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. 
took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Hold on, let us see where we are, where we are headed. This is the journey. And uh, Fafnir's Where is Fafnir's? I don't see... F oh, Fafnir's over here. Huh. Should we continue with the journey or just uh, continue exploring this area? Like, this is a brand new area, I think. With all these things revealed. Ooh, another one. A drink from the dew plus two. You know what? Uh, I think before maybe wow. we should have. There's two of them, and they're huge. I wonder why they aren't moving. Oh, we can't get in there, huh? Oh, these were the gates to uh, Thor's... Oh, fire. So this would be a totally different area now. And uh, we're just exploring stuff here. I don't think we're ready to uh, tackle anything much bigger than... You want to be here? These are all flame guys. Okay, did we get hurt? Mm hmm. So there's a level of free, free play here. Not really much. You know, like when the lake went down to its second level, maybe we should have actually checked, uh, looked around. So did we checking on the resources? Of 
oblivion stone, purest 